Hi, welcome. Uh, this is going to be a quick video for installing trusted certificates. So without further ado, let's go ahead and take a look at what is required and what we need to do. Okay, so I wanted to quickly record an, uh, an issue that presents itself every time there's a new implementation. And I'm going to go over the certificates. So here's the problem. When you go and do HTTPS, you're gonna get that the, the connection is not secure. So what do we do to fix that? Let me see. Collab engineer. engineer.com okay so we still have the connection not secure so we're gonna go to this guy and we're gonna go to the OS administration all right so I'm gonna log in save it why not the other thing that I want to do is go to my certificate of authority server uh, cert SRV and then I want to come here again certificate management I want to go to the Tomcat which is the one that we're replacing. So if you notice here, it says self-signed. So that's what you get every time you install any of the UC servers. And I'm gonna generate a CSR. Yeah, everything looks fine. Okay, so it says that it's already generated, so we're gonna close this, and this is supposed to change and show me the download the CSR. So I just downloaded that guy, and I wanna open it and see. We're gonna request a certificate, advanced certificate, we're gonna do web server. We're not gonna get complicated with this, but we could publish publish uh, different uh, templates on this Windows C8. And now what I wanna do is download this one. Okay, so now I want to rename this. This is the root CA. This one I just downloaded is Unity Cert But I want to change it and I want to do PEM. Okay, so now let's go back to Unity Connection. First thing that you want to upload is the root certificate, but you want to upload it to the Tomcat Trust. And this is going to be root CA root. I can have it like home DNS CA. And it's this bad boy right here. Okay, so that's done. Now when we close it, this thing is refreshing and it's gonna show somewhere RCA, which is this guy right here. 
and then we want to come here to the one that we just uh, downloaded generate CSR we're gonna upload it Tomcat and now if everything works fine the only thing that we need to do is to connect to this guy T I think he said 12. <coughs> yeah, 12. And I'm gonna copy this. This is kind enough to tell me what I need to do after everything's fine. I'm gonna copy that, close it. This is gonna refresh again, and it should say CA sign now. Oh, here for the trust. Tomcat only should say CA signed. Alright, now we're gonna close it. We're gonna close this guy, and then we're gonna come here and do the same thing. Either service to start. Cisco Tomcat. Now I'm gonna pause the video here. This is gonna restart. It's gonna take probably like five minutes, and then I'm I'm gonna come back. Now I know this is about to finish, so I just uh, resume the recording just to see what's gonna happen. Now one thing that I notice is that um, I use Firefox. I use Firefox in Firefox uses it has its own uh, store for for the certificates and that is a good thing but when we when we close the whole thing and go back again to it it's still gonna show that the certificate is not valid even even though i have the ca already as a as a trusted ca on this computer <coughs> So, home, unity, and that's going to need a few more minutes to come up. Oh, you know what? I already, I already added, this is what I was talking about the, under the preferences. Um, security, no, advanced, the certificates, I already added my home CA it should be under collaboration no it's this one right here nothing too fancy I just enabled the the raw on the Windows server and that's how I, I'm doing it right now. So that was how to get any UC application on, on the securities on the, under the a trusted certificate. Now with Contact Center Express it's gonna be a different story because we need to we need to generate more certificates, a couple more certificates, one for the COIC which is the reporting, one for finesse, and one for um, the Tomcat service. So hopefully we'll, we'll have that soon, and then we're gonna be able to test it. Thank you for watching.